Hey everyone, Chia here. Today we're going to explore painting light and shadow. Ever find yourself staring at a painting, wondering why it's so flat? Well, you're not alone. Some people blame it on being too frugal with paints, but for me, I find it's usually a matter of getting those tonal values just right. So in today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to fix a flat painting and transform it into something with more depth. For this purpose, I've chosen a simple fisherman cabin as our subject. And to save time, I've already blocked in the local colors. But as you can see, without the proper tonal variation, the painting lacks depth and dimension. We can't even differentiate each feature from another. We could resolve the problem by outlining with a pen, but we could also adjust the tonal values. When it comes to painting light and shadow, I often consider a few key factors. The first one is the light source. In this case, it's coming from the top left-hand corner, according to the reference photo. The second is the areas furthest from the light source, which is where our darkest shadows would be. The third one is the potential areas of reflected light. And finally, the areas closest to the light where I usually reserve the white of the paper for highlights. Using these principles, we can see that the right side of the cabin, along with the trees and the mini logs at the water's edge, will have deeper shadows. However, under the roof and along the boat sides, where there is also light and potential for reflected light, the shadows will be lighter. With that in mind, I proceeded to paint the shadows in.
And there you have it. By adding the appropriate shadows and reflections, our once flat painting has come to life with depth and realism. Mastering tonal values, in my opinion, is key to creating depth in your artwork, and it has completely transformed mine. I hope you find this video helpful in your own artistic endeavors. If you enjoy this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more art-related content. And I will see you in the next video.